Her story went viral. A mother who says that she was turned away from an HISD school when she tried to enroll her daughter because of how she, the mother, was dressed. Now new tonight, that school has issued an official dress code for parents. It's a story you saw first on two about two weeks ago. Now since we talked with that frustrated mother, Madison High School has gone forward with a plan making it clear how it believes parents should present themselves when they're on school grounds. It's a story that has received mixed opinion since the very beginning. Our Sally Mamdu is getting more of the reaction on campus. Sally? And their parents are outraged by this, calling this dress code ridiculous. Starting this month at James Madison High School, students won't be the only ones following a dress code. The same will go for their parents. So they did say something about what you're wearing. Uh, yeah, they handed me this piece of paper talking about we're supposed to give this to all the parents. This James Madison High School parent is referring to this letter issued by the school's principal, Carletta Outlay Brown, addressing guests and parents on a dress code they must follow. In the letter, the principal says, quote, Parents, we do value you as a partner in your child's education. You are your child's first teacher. However, please know we have to have standards. Most of all, we must have high standards. Among new guidelines listed on the letter include preventing anyone from entering the building or even being on school premises wearing a sand cap or a bonnet on their head. Shower caps of any kind are also not allowed. Hair rollers will no longer be permitted. These guidelines were put in place after Channel 2 News brought you this story of a Madison High School mother earlier this month who wasn't initially able to enroll her daughter because of what she was wearing and what was on her head. Parents we spoke to today don't agree with the new rules. I, I think it's ridiculous because they don't know the situation. You know, I had an emergency today. This woman is now just learning the new dress code as she was picking up her child. Basically, what you're wearing right now uh -huh. on your head is not allowed in there. <laughs> I guess. I guess that's because I have this on my head. You saying I can't go in there? Yes, that's the new dress code. I don't know who this new principal is, but she is out of control. And she says she doesn't see the relevance behind the dress code. I'm going to school, I'm going to go presentable. But if I have this on my head, I don't see how this a uh, bad example for a child. And we've reached out to HISD and they don't have a comment. In the meantime, the parent teacher student organization plans to hold a meeting inviting parents to discuss this new dress code. We're live in Southwest Houston, Sally Mabdu, KPRC, Channel 2 News.